Welcome back to Brain Bite Size. Today we're diving into something on many minds, relationships. But here's the twist. Instead of asking if you've found the right person, have you ever wondered if you are ready for a relationship? Stick around till the end because you might be surprised by what sign number six says about you. Number one, self-love and acceptance. This concept goes beyond the superficial understanding of simply feeling good about oneself. It's an in-depth realization and acceptance of who we are at our core, embracing our strengths and vulnerabilities. When we talk about self-love in the context of readiness for a relationship, it's about having a profound sense of self-worth and self-respect. This means recognizing that you don't need someone else to complete you. You are already a complete individual on your own. Self-love also manifests in how we treat ourselves. It's about setting healthy boundaries, respecting our own needs and feelings, and not compromising our values for the sake of being in a relationship. It's the understanding that being alone does not equate to being lonely. It's an opportunity to grow, understand oneself better, and cultivate a fulfilling life independently of a romantic partner. Number two, no more settling for less. This isn't about seeking perfection in a partner, but recognizing our self-worth and refusing to compromise on the fundamental aspects of a healthy and loving relationship. When we talk about not settling for less, it's about understanding that love should not be conditional. It's about knowing that we deserve a partner who respects, values, and treats us with kindness and understanding. This realization often comes from a place of self-love and self-respect. When we start to see ourselves as worthy and deserving of genuine affection and support, we begin to set higher standards for how we are treated in relationships. 3. Embracing your individuality. This means recognizing and accepting your unique qualities, quirks, and characteristics that make you, well, you. It's about understanding that you're not broken and don't need someone else to fix you. When you truly embrace your individuality, you bring authenticity and self-respect to an invaluable relationship. It's not just about being okay with who you are. It's about celebrating it. This self-acceptance means you're not looking for a partner to complete you, but rather to complement your already complete self. This translates to healthier dynamics in a relationship where you're not dependent on your partner for your self-worth or identity. Four, comfortable in solitude. This doesn't just mean you're okay with being alone. It's about finding joy and peace in your company. When you're comfortable in solitude, it indicates a deep level of self-sufficiency and emotional independence. You don't rely on others to fill your time or provide your happiness, which is a strong foundation for any healthy relationship. Being at ease with solitude also means you've likely spent time reflecting on who you are and what you want in life, including in a partner. This self-awareness is invaluable in a relationship because it means you're less likely to lose yourself in the partnership. You maintain your individuality, interests, and passions, making you more attractive to potential partners and contributing to a more balanced and fulfilling relationship. You're not looking for a savior. This is about recognizing that a healthy relationship isn't a rescue mission. It's a common misconception that finding the one will solve all our problems. But the truth is, a partner isn't there to save us from our challenges or insecurities. Instead, being ready for a relationship means understanding you are your hero. It's about having the strength and self-awareness to manage your life's ups and downs. When you're not looking for a savior, you approach relationships from a place of empowerment, not desperation. You're not seeking someone to fill a void or fix your life. Instead, you're looking for a partner to complement and share in your journey. This mindset shifts the dynamics of a relationship from dependency to mutual respect and support. Na six, happiness beyond relationship status. This idea revolves around the understanding that your happiness and fulfillment are not, and should not be, solely dependent on your relationship status. It's about recognizing that being single or in a relationship does not define your entire existence or level of contentment. You exhibit a profound sense of self-sufficiency and emotional maturity when you reach a point where you're genuinely happy with who you are and where you are in life. Irrespective of whether you're single or partnered, this state of being is not about resignation or a lack of desire for companionship. Rather, it's about deep-seated confidence and peace within yourself. It reflects a life filled with joy, purpose, and fulfillment from various sources, your hobbies, career, friendships, or personal growth endeavors. So, did any of these signs resonate with you? Remember, being ready for a relationship is as much about your state of mind as it is about finding the right person. If you found this video helpful, remember to like, share, and subscribe to Brain Bite Size for more insightful content. And drop a comment below to share which sign spoke to you the most. Until next time, keep loving and learning about yourself.